Welcome to the channel. So today we're detailing this DeLorean DMC-12. So if you've recently purchased one of these vehicles or you're detailing one for the first time, just a few points to, point to uh, mention. One is it's an early 80s specialist classic car, so treat it with respect. In fact, treat it very similar to a Lotus Esprit or an early uh, Maserati. It is very, some parts are very, very fragile. So as long as you treat it with respect and uh, you're careful with all of the parts, then you shouldn't have too much trouble. Areas for concern really on, on this, if it's not been uh, upgraded or modified, one is the uh, bonnet release. Uh, that can the cable can fray so be careful with that and the other one is on the boot uh, or the trunk the louver plastic uh, cover that can crack if it flexes in the wrong way and also the latches around the boot space and the bonnet can be quite fragile once you're aware of that everything should be okay this is a standard uh, full detail that we're doing on this um, DeLorean, DeLorean nothing special however because it's a, a stainless steel bodied vehicle nitrile powder free gloves or cotton gloves right from the start and that will prevent you getting any uh, fingerprints onto the bodywork which can be quite difficult to remove. So with regards to the detail itself, in most cases but not every case we start with the interior of the vehicle, do that first before we do the exterior. Um, standard detailing procedure with regard to uh, this car. The only thing that we do slightly differently is because it's a classic car, we give the rubber seals around the vehicle what's called a liquid molly treatment, which is basically a, a rubber cleaning and a nourishing um, liquid. And that preserves the uh, rubber seals around the car in the best uh, possible way. And we'll normally carry out that particular treatment every six months on a regular customers classic cars. I'll put a link in the uh, description below the video to uh, Liquid Molly so you can see exactly what we use. So just a couple of tips as we move through the detail on the interior of this uh, DeLorean. So these older style uh, sports cars or, or cars generally of, of that kind of era, early 80s, the interior trim fitment is shocking on some of the cars. This one is no different. So the panel gap can be quite large. Lots of debris gets um, attracted to those and, and stuck into those uh, panel gaps. So one thing that's really important is a decent, uh, quite a substantial detailing brush. The softer style brushes won't get that debris out. So we're using a, a vacuum and brush method uh, so this is absolutely crucial. The second thing is on these particular style of sports cars, the uh, low center of gravity sports cars, the seating is actually really close to the floor. So in order for us to be confident that we've cleaned uh, the underside of the uh, seat without actually having to remove the seat is we use uh, this particular device, which is basically a Dyson uh, vacuum cleaner fitment. But because we don't use Dysons, we use uh, other um, equipment then we use a, an adapter in the end which allows it to fit the particular vacuum cleaning that we've got so with regard to this fitment nice soft brush on the outside a uh, pickup piece of almost like velcro in the center and then obviously the gaps where the uh, suction can actually apply and remove the debris these are really really useful really low profile so it gets right underneath the seat
Okay, so that's the uh, interior detail done on the DeLorean. So things that are extra with regard to most of the classic cars that we do. So there's a UV protection spray on the plastics around the dashboard. That's a satin finish. We've got um, leather cream care conditioner on the seats, obviously after they've been uh, cleaned. And as I mentioned before, uh, liquid molly treatment of all the uh, rubber seals as well. Next thing is, we're going to move on to the exterior. Turn it on. Turn it on. 